Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and I hope you are well. In today's video, I am going to inform you about how you can apostille your documents in Turkey. It can be a marriage certificate or a birth certificate given by Turkish authorities. Or it can be a Turkish court decision or a Turkish power of attorney which is taken from a Turkish notary. You can apostille these documents by Turkish authorities and you can easily use them abroad. In this video, I'm going to inform you about all the necessary steps. Firstly, let's start with what is apostille. Apostille is a form of certification that is set out by the Hague Convention. Apostille is internationally recognized by the member countries and luckily Turkey is also a member country. So Turkey can issue apostille certificate and also if you have a foreign document with apostille certificate, you can use that document easily in Turkey. So, in conclusion, apostille facilitates the certification and the verification procedures of the documents so that you can use them abroad more easily. In the first step, you need to get the official document that you want to be apostilled. For that reason, you need to go to the relevant government office. For example, if you want to get your Turkish birth certificate, you need to go to the civil registry office and you need to get your birth certificate stamped and signed by them. It's very important that you tell the government officer in that relevant office that you want your document to be apostilled afterwards so that they will prepare the document with the original stamp and signature and its format will be ready for the apostilling process in the next step. After you get the original document, you need to get an apostille stamp from the relevant authority. The relevant authority in Istanbul and in other major cities such as Antalya and İzmir are Kaymakamlık, which is the district governor's office. For example, if you are in Şişli, you can go to the Şişli Kaymakamlığı in Istanbul and you can get your document apostilled from Şişli Kaymakamlığı, which is the district governor's office in Şişli district of Istanbul. If your document is in Ankara, Minister of Foreign Affairs is in charge for giving apostille documents to the original Turkish documents. So you need to go to the specific division of the Minister of Foreign Affairs. When you go to the relevant authority for apostilling your document, you need to present the original document and also your identification information. Your ID information can be Turkish citizenship card, Turkish residency card or it can be your passport. After you submit those two documents, the government officer will take a look at the document and it will check the authenticity of the document. If the document is authentic, then the government officer will issue a postal for that document. It will be as a separate stamp in the end of the document and it will have the relevant information about the document, such as the name of the document, who is the issuing person of that document and who is the person who gives the apostille to that document and also it will have the apostille number so that these numbers can be verified when you want to use that document abroad. Let me give you some information about the fees and costs of apostilling your documents in Turkey. Firstly, you need to check with the relevant authority that issues your first original document. You need to check if there is a fee for that document or not. Usually there are no fees for documents if you get them from Turkish government offices. For example, for birth certificate, Turkish civil registry office doesn't ask for a fee. However, you need to check if it's a special operation and if it's a special document which requires a fee or not. After you get the original document, you go to the authority for issuing a postal, which can be Kaymakamlık in Istanbul or Minister of Foreign Affairs in Ankara. In Istanbul, the Kaymakamlık, they don't ask for a fee for apostilling your document. It's totally free. However, I'm not sure about Minister of Foreign Affairs in Ankara because they ask for a fee for approving foreign documents when they come to Turkey. I know that, but I don't know if they ask for a fee for apostilling Turkish documents. So you can ask it to the Minister of Foreign Affairs and if there is a fee, I don't think that it will be a huge fee for a postal stamp. It would be something around 10 or 20 dollars. However, still I'm not sure. It's better that you verify with Minister of Foreign Affairs. 
In the final section, I'm going to tell you how you can get an apostille for the notarized translation of an original Turkish document. For example, let's say you have a birth certificate in Turkish language from Turkish authorities and you want to use it in Germany. And let's assume Germany asks for that document to be in German language. There are two possible scenarios. You can get your original Turkish birth certificate, you can get it apostilled, then you can take that document to Germany and make the translation procedures according to the German laws in Germany. Another alternative is that after you get your original document from the Turkish authority, you can get it translated and notarized at Notary Public in Turkey and after that you can get an apostille for the notarized version of the translation so that the document will be translated into German and notarized at the notary and the translated German version will get the apostille stamp in Turkey so that you will not need any additional translation steps in the third country. Now you know how to get your document apostilled in Turkey. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to my channel and you can view more content that might be beneficial for you. Thank you very much for watching this video and if you have any questions, you can always comment it below and I will reply. See you next time.